Okay, so making a hola client. What I've got here is some water with plenty, 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 plenty of salt dissolved in the water. And this salty water, what I'm going to do is add some blue food colouring to the salty water. And give this a really good mix. So this blue salty water, you can see it, should be denser. And we'll pop that into the gas jar. Now I'll let it settle, I'll let it stop moving, and then just a little bit to rinse out the salt. So that now what I'm going to have is fresh water. Fresh water, pink, ooh, nice pretty pink, bit of food colouring there. So, we've got a nice clear contrast of colours. And so, hopefully, what this will look like is fresh water from a river running into the sea. So, fresh water runs down to the seawater, meets the seawater, and try not to drip pink food colouring too much. Fresh water should be less dense and so hopefully it should float on top of the denser salt water and this is what would happen in a river estuary as a river runs into the sea so on the top we've got fresh on the bottom we've got salt, fresh water is pink, salt water is blue, and there in the middle we have a lovely clear halo cline. Salt water, fresh water. Now if I get this right and I prepare just a little bit of salt not as much salt as I had before in fact just gonna get rid of it a little bit just in case because I don't need a great deal of water here So this is going to be in between. This is this water is going to be what we would call brackish water. So not quite salt water, but it's got more dissolved salts than fresh water. And this we're going to give a bit of yellow food colouring. Be able to see it, and the idea here would be that if I pour this 
down the side it should sink below the fresh water but float above the salt water and this is very difficult to get this to work so cross your fingers as you're watching this video and let's see what happens I'm going to stop a second and I'm going to just take away a little bit of the fresh water because I think there's a bit too much there on top so even though I've moved it you can see the thermocline there is still very very clear so even after a bit of movement there's still no mixing and hopefully the yellow brackish water should be sinking below the pink fresh water and making a layer underneath the pink fresh water down the front there and I'm not sure whether we can just make this out but my yellow has picked up a bit of the red and it's turned a bit purpley but you can just make out a layer there in between the two here if we watch it set up and I'll get some white paper behind this so you can see the colours more clearly And more than yellow, it's turned a bit purple that colour. But you can see, we've got a layer red, we've got a layer a bit purpley, and here we've got a layer of blue. So we have got three clear layers, even though the colours have gone a bit funny. So here, fresh, brackish, salt, different layers, and I've got two halo clines, one here and one about there.